We can't say that we weren't forewarned. Kia has been dropping broad hints about its plan to produce a rear-wheel drive sedan for years. The original GT concept was shown at the Frankfurt Auto Show as long ago as 2011, with the Stinger GT4 building on it at the 2014 Detroit Show. Now the wait is finally over as the company has unveiled the production version of its forthcoming sports sedan, which adopts the Stinger name. Don't confuse it with the K900. The Stinger is a much sleeker and sportier proposition than its staid big sister, and it has a low, coupe-like roofline. Power will come from two engines, with the range-topping 365-horsepower turbo 3.3-liter V6 making that version the most powerful road-going Kia yet, a 255-horsepower 2.0-liter 4-cylinder will serve as the entry-level engine. The Stinger gets an 8-speed automatic transmission, with buyers able to choose between rear and all-wheel drive. Kia says it is targeting a 5.1 second 0 to 62 mile per hour time and a 167 mile per hour top speed for the 3.3 liter. There also will be a diesel version for Europe, but there are no plans to bring it to the States. The design certainly is aggressive, it is the work of Kia's European design studio in Frankfurt. Up front, there's the brand's familiar tiger nose grille. But behind that, the low stance and muscular proportions effectively distinguish the Stinger from anything else the company has produced. Buyers will be able to have fun by getting their buddies to guess the brand of their new car when seen in profile. There's something distinctly Alfa Romeo-ish about the rear end small.